all our fucking opinions, man. I swear. I'm going to get some weird, crazy ass fucking people with some crazy. No, it's going to happen. It's going to fucking happen. So don't. It's a disclaimer. This is our dust. I'm going to make sure y'all see that shit it in is the box. What it is, yo. What is up, Blaze Squad? Welcome to. We just gonna talk. Just gonna like, talk. We just gonna talk about a lot of different shit. I don't have a problem with YouTube because everybody does the shit they do on YouTube. Whatever you do is your shit. Whatever you say is it's you. Amy, it's not affecting me. I don't know y'all personally, so it doesn't really bother me. But it is some crazy shit going on. I gotta admit though, like one of the one of the realest things I seen lately was um McJugger Nuggets. The, the YouTube money, the third one he did, when he was saying just keep throwing shit against the wall until something sticks. Like, it was a funny-ass analogy, but it's the truth. It's true, yeah. It's the truth. Just just some of the things that he was saying. Like, if you put the same amount of time you would put into a job into YouTube. I can give you on a smaller level that same comparison. I started a YouTube channel in 2011 for my website. And it was only to promote specific products of my website instead of doing the gameplays and mm -hmm. adding them and doing all that and you know i got a, a decent following for what i'm trying to do all i'm trying to do is direct traffic to my web page for people who are interested in just that and go ahead tell them what that is so they know well i run a website called madden universe i run i sell ebooks tips things like that and strategy guys but I also, when I first started, posted a couple gameplays, too. You yeah. know, voiceovers and all that stuff of Madden and things like that. And give out some free tips here and there on YouTube. But at that time, I was more focused on my website. You know, I could have easily done a video a day on YouTube. As many games as I play Madden every day. Like, I put in six, seven hours on average when it's that time. This year is probably going to be more because of the tournaments and stuff. But... Had I put an hour of that time into making, uh, into editing one of the gameplays for YouTube, my channel growth would have been at a much higher peak, a much higher arc than what it is. Because if you compare it back to you, how long have you been doing YouTube? A year or some change. Okay, so I got four and a half years on you, basically. But look at you, you, you have more subscribers than I do. Yeah. And that basically boils down to the fact you work harder at YouTube. Yeah, that's than I do. Like, yeah. like looking at her, like what y'all don't realize, what y'all don't see behind the scenes is this shit is a lot of fucking work. <laughs> it is. <laughs> this it shit is. is a lot of fucking work. Oh my god, it is. Like all the editing and all the time. Spent. Not to mention, I got three kids. You guys, there's a reason. Yeah. I, I gotta record certain night times of the day. I gotta get on a computer only certain time. I can't get on a computer as much as I want to get on a computer. So yeah, yeah if I had the even more time to actually work. I probably could be, you know, doing a little bit better. But I am I actually surprised as shit. Like, I'm at fucking three thousand subscribers. How the fuck does that happen? Cause you putting in work. You doing your work and you yeah, progressing. But, like, like if you look at your first video and you look at yeah, your videos yeah, now. Yeah, that first video I kinda wanted to you put went on from private completely, so nobody can see it. You went from completely being shy, scared to death without even having a camera. Yeah. Yeah, even, still, when, even when you didn't have the camera, you were still, you know, yeah. dead ass nervous. And, like, that's the thing. Like, if you just keep it what you're doing and you keep working, that, that goes Somebody, for anything yeah, in life. Somebody's going to like you. Like, a lot of, I get people who don't like my cursing. They sit there and say some sh crazy shit. And, you know, I'm not for everybody. It is what it is. But those to, to those who do come around and still watch my shit, I appreciate the hell out of you guys, for real. Because I was surprised as fuck. Fudge that I'm interesting. <laughs> like what? No, and see that's that's the that's the other thing too. Like that a lot of people don't get. There's a there's a generational gap. Yeah. Just in society, period. Not just in YouTube, but just the mind state of the way things think. The younger. And if you look at it, you can see that in a lot of the drama that's going on. And guys, I'm not speaking on one particular person, one community, anything like that. Because no matter what community you look at, there's drama involved. Yeah. Whether you look at Call of Duty. Madden, FIFA, whatever that's competitive gaming wise, you got drama. The you know you got not dramas. everybody want to fucking share. Everybody should just damn share. Let's all yeah, that's share. What I'm saying. And it's then, like skateboarding. Skateboarding. Everybody scared. Like they everybody, yeah. Each everybody other. appreciate each other. Just like probably UFC. Everybody yeah. appreciate each other. Let's get that shit on YouTube. Yeah, too. exactly. It's like it's like some people feel like for them to grow, they gotta demean someone bigger than them. 
And see, that's the thing about me. Like, if, if someone says something about me, I'm not going to fucking reply. Yeah, that's what I'll reply. Like, my thing is, my thing is, that's not my thing. Like, the internet back and forth, yeah. like... Don't talk shit to me on here. Like, I don't give a fuck. I don't like, know. Like, yeah, exactly. You. I don't know you. You don't know me. It is what it is. Let's move on. You you got your opinion. Much respect to your opinion. Whatever going on in your day that day, you got You have a bad day. That's fine. But go ahead. Say what you got to say. Move on. And I'll do the same. It's not going to hurt. It's not going to affect me now. I trust me. I, I'm already getting the, the stupid yeah. ass comments already and the weird ass email from people like, it's like i understand everybody goes through they gotta be they gotta make their mistakes trust me we all made our mistakes at yeah. a young age so you know you you learn from it and you move from it and you try not to do it again if y'all see drama going on on youtube i'm not going to respond to it i'm not going to get into it um i don't care about views on that shit it's not something that's not the route i'm trying to go with my channel and it's not going to go Oh, let's talk about what happened with such and such and such and such today. I don't give a damn. It, it had nothing but my name in it. I don't exactly. care. Exactly. It's not my business. Exactly. It's not my and business. Like, there's too much shit. And some of some of this shit though, some of this drama do get played just so people can get views of it. Nah, like, but like, like just like um the video I was talking about with McJuggernuggets. When you find something that works, milk it until it don't work no yeah, more. Yeah, that's what they're doing. And man. like, I can't bl necessarily blame some of them because there's some YouTubers that's doing it just to do it. And I think they're person personally, I think they're probably fucking cool with each other. To be honest with you, I don't think they got that big of a fucking issue with each yeah. other. A lot of people. But, you know, they got to do what they got to do to fucking, you know, make their living, make their money. And Nuggets is, is, is the real, he got, what it comes to, he, like, he told it all, like, legit, y'all haven't checked out any of his videos, for real, for real, go ahead and check that shit out, because he tells you it all. The only thing he hadn't really went into was, the, um, the, the, was the analytics studies and things like that, and follow, and like, exactly how to Follow the trends, but yeah. still in your own way. That cycle series shit was dope, yo. Like, I'm not gonna lie to you. I had my, I had. My I knew moment. it was fake for a while. Yeah, we. Uh, it was yeah, I wasn't sitting there thinking. At first, it was he could have probably played it up, but things just started not adding up. Yeah, I'm just saying. I'm <laughs> just saying. I just want to give you props on it. Like you know, that shit was crazy. crazy. I, he probably won't see this shit. But the, but the other thing he said that was really real was like you know you think about it. There's over a billion people on YouTube. Crazy, right? So if there's a billion viewers on YouTube, awesome. there's more than that actually. But say there's a billion and your goal is a million, that means you only need one one thousand of the viewers on YouTube to like your shit. And there's something for everyone, y'all. Y'all know. There's and something. really, not even that many people have to like your shit because once you get to a certain level. People who don't like your shit are still we'll going to watch your watch shit. Yeah. Exactly. And I so, appreciate those people too. If you don't it, like yeah, me, you like, grin behind that computer screen wanting to punch my face right now. I love you. Oh, yeah, dead ass. I still you, love you. Some of the other shit I get, like sent to my game attack, is fucking crazy, yo. I take the time to respond to those who asking questions yeah, and, yeah. you know, giving me my props and shit. But those who want to write me and still be nasty, just know... It, 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 you might never get a reply from me. I can say that multiple times, but we all know what's going to happen. How many dudes saying you stupid shit? Um, like I've got, them, right? Ever since being on YouTube, I've got a couple of pictures that I don't care to discuss. <laughs> Makes me want to go ball up in the corner. Yo! <laughs> I'm talking to a, a damn game that gets me so fucking frustrated that I want to fucking break my fucking computer. But that, that's just besides the point. Y'all okay? have no idea. Shit, man. Because y'all see 10 minutes of this game plays. If Don't, that. Oh, yo. Who yo, some of these games, perfect. yo, she be getting so perfect. mad, son. It be an hour straight. And I'm, my throat, and I'm my... two rooms away down the hallway. So in between here, you got a washer and dryer, <laughs> a bathroom, <laughs> A room and then the master bedroom. Through all them walls, I can hear her over my headphones with the fucking monitor. I just gotta, on I just gotta soundproof my room more, better. Soundproof. <laughs> There's no level of fucking sound. Oh, no. look, I love video games. The ones that I can do. I love <laughs> video games, right? But when it comes to these games that is special to Mario Maker, you guys with y'all levels, y'all great with it. But God, my God, calm down. Y'all are getting me fucking great. Y'all are getting me going Yo, I'd be crazy. dying laughing at this shit, though. That shit is like, me. Like, 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 while I'm looking at the levels that you sent me. <laughs> that 
shit just be <laughs> yeah, off I'm the looking ch- like, yo, I'm so happy wait, wait, that wait, ain't wait. me right now. Do they still say off the chain? No. <laughs> I think cheesy. you should edit this part out because people is going to clown the fuck out you. I don't care if people clowning me. Just to give y'all a little background on us, um, I am from the suburbs. And, and I'm not. He's at not. All. Yeah. Like, he is. Uh, no. You know, I was a military <laughs> kid. I was a military kid and I was spoiled and all that shit and blah, blah, blah. You know, it's, and. It's not so much words. Is is what you say, how you say it, and if you're directly stating it towards me. Look, and that's the thing. Right? I can understand to a point you can get mad at certain things, especially when it comes to your kids. Like, when it comes to my kids, oh, yeah, fuck, it's fuck, a, yeah, fuck yeah, say yeah, something yeah, about yeah, my kids. Yeah, yeah. I would go down your throat. Huh? <laughs> I was going to leave it alone, though. Like, But um, I will get in your ass. She, oh, oh, shit. God. <laughs> so, <laughs> what she basically saying, she going to go in your mouth and pull that little bit of thug out but yeah, when it comes to my kids, it's different. But when somebody says something to you, why, why get like to a point where you want to get in their face? All right, if someone got up in my face growing up and just started popping off in my popping off in my face and running their mouth, if I just sat there and didn't do nothing, not a thing, I everybody around is gonna try me, yo. And not only that, I'm probably gonna get jumped by the people I'm really cool with. Because they're going to be like, why you let him do that to you? Because that makes all of us look soft. Yeah, and I, I I see, like, look, I even though I was raised in the suburbs, I've got, I we had a situation in my, my where it I had yeah, pretty much, yeah, yeah, it got bad. So I've seen it. Trust me, I've seen some shit. Nah, per like, se, you're, but you're I, I, just, I don't, I don't fuck, I don't do nah, confrontation. You avoid it. You I avoid, avoid confrontation. It. But see, that's the thing. Like I've gotten better with yeah, that. Yeah, I've yeah. gotten a lot better at that. I think I owe that to the military. To be honest with you, that and you and the kids. Yeah. See, now people say shit and I hear it. Yeah, like behind it, like they talk. We're down south, by the way. Just because I sound like I'm from, I'm from up north and I grew up in an up north household. We're down south right now, and if you look at us. <laughs> we not exactly the fan favorites, all right, if you know what I mean. Especially with the older, lighter crowd that is more around my complexion. Let's just put it that way. Okay? <laughs> yeah. So when I see the dude that's probably 50 years old, some of them younger than that, with the Confederate flag on his shirt, looking at me up and down like this and this, and looking at you and the kids a certain type of way. Ignore it. I'm going to ask him what his fucking problem Ignore is. Ignore it. Because... Cause, nah, because to me, you basically... He ain't just, like, looking at me. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, I know. Like, I know. And that's the thing. I know that part. You don't have... Look, I guess because I've gotten... Like, I don't want to say that either because, you you know, you've gotten your share of dumbass <laughs> comments, too. So... But it's just son. like... <laughs> you going to call me what you call me. Trust me. I've gotten the word. We all know the word. Okay? And that make you feel better? All right. To you, I am that. But to me, I am not. So it doesn't matter whether or not you're calling me that. No, nah, but really just to wrap it up is basically we just come from different backgrounds and like our they patterns of thinking different. is different. Now, Way different. But the different, but see, here's the thing though. Like, like if I do something stupid, I can't just use that as an excuse though. No, it yeah, is it's just, like I said, like, half, I think half of the stuff comes with age and you get a little bit older and wiser and you figure out what's really important in your life and what's not that important anymore. You know? Exactly. There's no way. Because you know why? Because you bettered yourself for your kids. Yeah, that's true. So there you go. But Shout out to my babies. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just had a mommy moment. I'm good. Oh, like all I'm going to say is, rest in peace, Aubrey, a.k.a. Drake. <laughs> that man was Drake. He was never Drake to me, okay? He was the grassy's <laughs> Jimmy. And everybody's surprised now. Yo, Joe Button thrashed that dude. <laughs> sometimes I love rap, and sometimes Yo, it's really thrashed aggravating. thrashed that dude. So, I don't like talking about rap music. Cause Why sometimes is it's Joe, just I'm so... reimbursing you. No! Metal up behind this mouse, Sprite commercial you with the metal shit with the Drake put. Dog. <laughs> this is a rap battle, dude. Like, he listened to all that rap battle shit. I listen to it randomly when I'm in the mood. I, I like I like who I like. and. But if you really look at it, there's battle rappers that 
can out rap everybody. Loaded Lux, Daylight. Yeah, I said Daylight. Daylight is nice. JC, people like that, man. No, Everybody I like got, Drake. No, I no. like Drake as an artist. Yeah, I, I didn't like his new album, but all his other shit was fire to me. But just as a rapper, I see, and that's why he made the new album because of shit like this. That that's why. That's why we just got a trash ass Drake out because of this shit. Right <laughs> I don't here. like that song. I hate that damn. But that song. shit stuck in your fucking head. Yeah, though. exactly. That's you know that's. But like Hobson can't get no love. Oh my poor dude, man. Here's a perfect example. The Bad Me Evil album with Royce the Five Nine and Eminem. Why did everybody buy that album? Who was clearly the better artist on that album? Royce was clearly the better artist on that album. No one talked about him. All they right. talked about was Eminem coming back. All right, now I'm going to have to defend my Eminem. Son, on that <laughs> album? <laughs> you know how it goes, man. I don't care what Eminem does. Yo, he son, can no, shit in the I'm box talking about the cool that shit. album. Honestly, I didn't pay attention Listen to back, because you probably only listen to Eminem. Yeah, you Royce. know. That's what happens. That's what happens. You get your artist. Look, that's what I'm saying about this Drake shit. People like Drake because they like Drake. And you like Joe Budden because you like Joe Budden. Everybody got their opinion on what's good and what's not good music. It is what it is. I like Eminem, so I didn't pay attention. Even though Rose, he's good. I like Eminem too. He's good, but I didn't listen to him enough to care. And that's, that's, what, that's how the mindset is. Like, oh, you know, people like Iggy Azalea. Oh, I people like Nicki Minaj. Why is our female I like rappers Nicki, like this, raps. man? Why is our female rappers like this? And hey, Lil' Kim, I don't even want to start on that bitch. Good God. Y'all saw Lil' Kim later? Yo, and who was it? Rich Homie Kwan? You cannot forget Biggie lyrics at a Biggie tribute. <laughs> and who the fuck at VH1 thought it was a good idea? Rich Homie to make Rich Homie Quan do the tribute for Biggie. Rich Homie Quan is pretty goddamn cool, isn't he? He looks awesome. That's why he's up on the stage. With his tight ass fucking baby mama's jeans on? Hey, yo. Yo, so no, let me give y'all a disclaimer what the. I should have put this at the beginning of the video. This is all our fucking opinions, man. I swear. I'm going to get some rare, crazy ass fucking people with some crazy. No, it's going to happen. Gonna fucking happen. So don't. It's a disclaimer. This is our thoughts. I'm gonna make sure y'all see that shit it in the box. It is what it is, yo. It is what it is. Some rock and roll. Some classic. Don't I? I listen music. to different music too, though. I used to listen to country. I stopped listening. To I country. ain't never listened to country. That shit's depressing. Country. I apologize to anybody who's a country fan. I used to listen to it. I just feel, I find it depressing a lot of times. We talk about train. Train was great. Who? Train. Drops a Jupiter, man. That's that girl song, man. That's train, though. And yeah, but that back, song was only rock. made for y'all. Like, don't no dude like that song. Would I be made fun of if I said I had actually like Nickelback? <laughs> I'm not a fan because every song sounds the same to me. However, no, I would not make fun of you. Yo, man, like, I'm interested because I want to see how they portray the Joker. Because this Joker is technically supposed to be the Joker, like, Ooh, he got a, Yeah, he got replaced. It's supposed I don't to know be the sick-minded those, Joker, not the funny Walking those footsteps, one. man, of he... So, him following Heath Ledger? He got some big fucking shoes to fill. I'm going to say that, because that dude... R. Yo, R. that's, man, that's one of the best real. acting jobs I've ever seen. Like, like, there's two different types of Jokers. You got that cynical... Fucked up in the head, he, you know, Ledger. The, and then you had the, the fucking funny, Jack. The funny, yeah, funny jackass, the you jokey know one. The joke, you know the who should have played the Joker when that was funny Joker? Jim Carrey instead of him playing Riddler. Even yeah, though he did when, good as Riddler. When the was, Joker came yeah, out, that, that was that, way yeah. before. That was Jack Nicholson when he was younger. And I thought he did a really good job Yeah, he was, he was. I thought the dude that played Batman in that movie was terrible. We I figured know, out. We get in the Dark Knight though. Christian Bale was not. I like Christian Bale, and I think he did a good job. I like Christian Bale, but I heard so much bad shit about Christian. Bale. No, he. I, from what I heard, he's a dick. <laughs> but he's good. But he's but good. Yo, he's, he's good. He's good. Man. He's good. Like I mean, that's why he keep getting these big roles. I mean, think about it. He had the one movie where he lost weight to the point where he looked completely. Oh anorexic. my god! Yeah, that was. Oh my god! Please get the movie in my head. Brain pop up. Then you he got the movie. He played a crackhead as the boxer. 
Yeah. And they was really doing a documentary on him falling off. And he thought in his own mind that he was, they was doing a documentary on him fighting. Yeah. While the same time Mark Wahlberg, you know, was coming up in the ranks as an yeah. actual boxer. That was Which good. is crazy. Mark and then, yeah, but then you got, then you got Christian Bale playing as Batman and he buffed himself up for it. Like, he's, he's dedicated to what he's doing, man. I ain't got no... All right, Blaze Squad. If you guys like the video, go ahead and hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Um, if you want to see more of me in here with her, let me know. Because the reason I don't do videos with her because I'd be like, man, I don't want to fucking see my ugly ass. Oh, no, no, give me a smash. <laughs> Men, we are stuck in a situation Men. where I can't even fucking say something fucked up back to her for that shit. Because I'm going to get ass raped by the people in these comments. Ass rape? What? Okay, we got to go. We got to go. What? No. <laughs> what the hell? What? Ass rape? <laughs> what?